My name is Mimi Obanswin, and this song is called You Found Me. I don't think I ever got into music. I think I was just born into it. My parents loved music and they always put us in music lessons and dance lessons and I don't know, we always had music going on in the background. But I think one of the biggest influences when I was younger and still now was um, the landscape where I'm from. You know, the outside, the animals, all these teachers that I had around me definitely were, you know, my partners <laughs> when I was younger. Like a breeze in the winter, whistling and giving me shit. I didn't go to school for music. Every time I perform with my band, I feel like I go to school because they're so well versed and they bring in all these really cool influences. So I'm kind of like a sponge. I like to like take in everything wherever I go and I listen to like a wide variety of music. But I mean, my people are uh, Bob Marley, Robbie Robertson, obviously Buffy St. Marie, like who doesn't love her, uh, Ben Harper, and I don't know, I just kind of like absorb things and, and I'm a big feeler, so I love things that have like that heartbeat rhythm and a lot of percussion and kind of speak to, you know, that earthiness, that thing inside of me. I can't believe I get to play really, really great places. I think like being an independent artist nowadays, like I have to find creative spaces for me to perform my music. One of the coolest places uh, was in India when we were touring and it was my birthday and we were playing at this place called Guru Bar and it was like on the side of the ocean and half the club was like in the sand and I was playing with two of the guys I play with in Toronto and a drummer uh, from India. And I don't know, it was just like such good vibes. The place was packed, people were like dancing and singing. It was really fun and just really energetic and colorful and great. I do workshops with uh, youth and in those workshops I talk about the healing properties of music but also how uh, music speaks to us on a human level. I believe that our first experience as human beings is music and it runs through our bodies and our veins. That's why it speaks to us on like a you know subconscious level. Sometimes we feel things through music that we didn't know we felt. So I tell young people that it's a tool we can have you know to, to share or to connect or to have our voices be heard or um, you know, just kind of an expression. Some of the things that my parents instilled in me that I find very valuable is uh, the value of hard work. And if you want to write songs, you should do that. And then you should put in the hours and make it the best you can. This is Mimi Obanswin and you're watching Digital Drum.